If you're looking for the best plaque lipstick, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have NYX Professional Nail Makeup Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick, Alien Black. Let's start with the best drugstore black lipstick that also happens to be cruelty-free. NYX Liquid Black Lipstick is affordable and beloved by women around the world. It's creamy when applied and dries to a matte finish within a couple of minutes. It comes with a doe foot applicator that's handy for drawing a symmetrical lip line. The lipstick doesn't typically bleed, so it's pretty easy to get clean edges even without a liner. The formula is long-wearing, but drying. It helps to apply lip primer or balm underneath. Still, plan on touching it up after eating. Thankfully, it doesn't get on teeth or flake off as some matte black lipsticks do. So, what's the downside? In our opinion, the color looks best with at least two coats. This requires a few extra minutes because of the dry time. Also, it's not 100% flat, it's more satiny. Moving on to the next and number two with Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipstick with C, he is. Which brand has the best black lipstick? Most would agree that it's Kat Von D. This waterproof black lipstick is pitch black and kiss proof. It doesn't transfer even when you're eating, but it will fade if you don't layer it. The compact doe foot applicator makes it easy to do exact lines. The initial texture is creamy, but it dries flat black. It's probably the best matte finish we've seen. Although the formula has conditioners like sunflower seed wax and vitamin E, it's still a good idea to keep your lips hydrated with a moisturizing lip balm when you take off the lipstick. The number three position is held by Rimmel Stay Matte Lip Liquid, Pitch Black. This intense velvety black matte lipstick promises 12-hour wear. Yet the reviews are full of people complaining that it clumps, flakes, cracks, and fades sooner than that. How can you get the best performance out of it? First, the brand claims that one stroke is enough. We recommend two layers with adequate drying time between them. But it's actually the preparation that's key. Before applying the lipstick, exfoliate your lips. Get rid of any dryness or flakes. You don't need an expensive lip exfoliator for that. A damp washcloth or soft toothbrush can do the job. Next, apply lip primer or lip balm and let it completely dry down. That's the essential part because it keeps the lips conditioned and prevents the lipstick from cracking. The formula itself is very lightweight and you're likely to forget you're wearing it. If you're not comfortable with the extreme black shade, let it dry completely and smooth on a gloss top coat. This will soften the color. Next at number four, we have Maybelline New York Super Stay Mad Ink Liquid Lipstick. If you love long wear lipstick, You've got to try Maybelline's Matte Black Liquid. It's good for up to 16 hours without smudging, transferring, or flaking if it's applied properly. This is true even if you're wearing a protective mask. We're not kidding, you're going to need makeup remover to get it off. The rich black shade is matte and bold. Moreover, it's straightforward to apply flawlessly because of the arrow-shaped applicator. Now, about how to apply it, put on thin coats only and let it dry completely between them. Two layers should be enough for most people. The number five position is held by Manic Panic Raven Lethal Lipstick Cream Tones. So far, we've reviewed only liquid lipstick, but we know that's not everybody's favorite thing. If you prefer a creamy stick lipstick that moisturizes your kisser, check out this option. It has a buttery texture that goes on smooth and sets semi-matte. Plus, it's packed in a pretty tube. Although this is not the blackest black, it's still bold, and like other makeup products from this brand, it's cruelty-free and contains no talc, lead, parabens, or glue. Build it in layers to intensify the color. Two coats seem to be the sweet spot as this is a cream tone shade and not as highly pigmented. Since it doesn't set as fast as a liquid lipstick, you can work it with your fingers or a brush. Does it smudge? Yes, us, unfortunately. And you'll need to touch it up after drinking or eating. On the other hand, it keeps the lips comfy and soft throughout the day. The number six position is dominated by Revlon Super Lustrous The Luscious Matte Lipstick, 20 Onyx. Is Onyx the same as black? Sadly, no, it's a deep charcoal gray. If you don't mind doing without deep black, 
The onyx color is a little bluish, and it makes teeth look whiter. This super pigmented lipstick might win your heart because the formula is deliciously hydrating. It features botanicals like Moringa Oil, Agave, and Kupuaku Butter to keep your pout pretty. But even though it's moisturizing, it looks and feels like velvet when it dries. Furthermore, for a demi-matte shade, it's surprisingly smooth and not sticky or difficult to apply. Reviewers suggest wearing two coats with primer for maximum coverage and wear time. Also, it's interesting that the tube has a finish that's similar to the finish of lipstick, Soft Matte. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Covergear El Katie Cat Matte Lipstick created by Katy Perry, Perry Panther. Were you wondering when we'd get to this lipstick? After all, it's super popular. And not just because of the low price or the celebrity who designed it. If you're curious but hesitant about wearing black lipstick, this is a good place to start. In the pictures, the color looks richly pigmented and satiny. Smooth? The satiny part is accurate, but the intensity of the color needs a little help. We highly recommend using liner or concealer to outline the lips first. Then, apply lip balm before layering at least two coats of lipstick. It sets slow enough that you can use a brush with it. There are no complaints about how well it moisturizes, it's much more hydrating than many liquid lipsticks are. Still, prepare yourself to touch it up throughout the day because it's not transfer resistant. The number 8 position is held by Covergear L Exhibitionist Lipstick Metallic, Don't Tell 555. Yes, you can get metallic black lipstick. This one is inexpensive, shimmery, and feels comfortable on the lips. It won't give you the deepest black color, but it has a unique appeal. Moreover, it's long wearing and more resistant to smudging and transferring than the lipstick above. That's true even though it's enriched with she butter and moisturizers. You might even need makeup remover to clean it off. Next at number 9, we have NYX Macker and Lippy and Chainboard. Chainboard by NYX is a deep, dark black with neutral undertones and a glossy sheen. It has a rich, creamy texture and it applies fairly well. This is enough pigmentation, but there could be more. However, its color is buildable and you can manage to get an opaque finish in two swipes. It's neither too drying nor too hydrating, it's somewhere in the middle. It's important to line your lips with a black liner before you go in with this to prevent it from feathering. Overall, this is full value for money and is worth trying. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Revlon Midnight Mystery. The Midnight Mystery by Revlon, enriched with avocado oil and vitamin E, it adds a rich and creamy black color to your lips. This lipstick is lightweight, easy to apply, and feel less buttery in your lips. All you need is just one stroke and flaunt a glam look with this shiny, smooth black shade. That's all for today. We upload beauty product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.